going on the friends? My name is M238 and welcome back to another episode of Castlevania Aria of Sorrow. You thought that the last part was the end of the game because, you know, we beat we beat the game. No, there's still a bit more. So, um, what you just saw was one way to beat the game and now there is another way. So, we're going to go ahead and show off that way next. Um, I gotta go ahead and, and re-get some of the stuff because I did save, um, before getting all, all the stuff. So, that's a bit of a shame. But that's okay. Because this is all for fun. Alright, so we gotta get that mana prism again. And, uh, once again, I don't know what the point of that guy is. It's, he's just, it's, it's just there. So, you know, that's cool. You're too late, Soma! Dracula's power is already in my grasp. Dracula's power doesn't concern me. I came here to find a way out of this castle. With my new abilities, I can get you out of here quite easily. You, however, have some property of mine in your possession. The souls of my demons are under your control. Can I forgive such a crime? No, never. If I knew how, I'd return them all to you right here and now. Even if you return them, you still have committed the crime of stealing! Don't you know that? It's only uh, it's only right that thieves receive the punishment they deserve. You are one selfish bastard. You're guilty of grand theft, therefore I sentence you to death. You're insane. And as a special treat, I myself will deliver the punishment. Alright. So, we have seen this part already. Uh, but, um, we can show this off again. It's fun. Uh, but, um, yeah, so, um, the fight's pretty easy. You, all you do is, uh, he's going to, um, um, stand at a certain spot, and, um, you, you, you just gotta duck at a certain spot, um, and most of the time you will not get hit by his attacks, so, um, yeah, alright, um, so, go ahead and start equipping the, uh, souls that we need, which is the Flame Demon Giant Band Succubus, and whenever you have, um... I can't believe it! How did you come to possess those powers? What do you mean by those powers? I'm Dracula, and you're not the one! So, um... And whenever you have Dracula's powers equipped, uh, then... Um... You gain 5 HP every time you land a hit. It's pretty crazy. Also, these enemies hurt. But that's fine, because we, we get healed up every time we attack. No! This cannot be! Does this mean that I'm not Dracula? Uh-oh. Something is flowing into me. No, wait! Please, stop! No! Oh boy, what just happened? Finally. I clearly understand everything. I am Dracula. This is like a bad joke. Come on out, Arakado. I know you're here. Why did you force me to awaken? I was just fine as I was. Yes, you weren't supposed to come to this castle in the first place. How did I end up here then? Your soul and Dracula's magical powers are one and the same. No matter what we did, this day was destined to come. That being so, I decided to awaken you. Somewhere I could use my powers. What do you mean? I don't understand. Because you are now one with him, an evil spirit must be flowing into you. Yes, it started out not too long ago, and it's slowly filling me up. I'm doing all I can to keep from to keep from being consumed by it. Once you have finished absorbing all of it, his powers will be yours. You will then become the evil count. I do not want to let that happen. Neither do I. I know. This is why I chose the dangerous route. The dangerous route? The evil in the spirit comes from those who seek chaos and destruction. So we need to cut off the source of the chaos influencing the spirit. Is that possible? This castle is a product of Dracula's magic. It's a spiritual world. My point is, is this. A stream of chaos exists within this castle as well. There's a place where only you, Dracula, can go. That's where the chaos is. I'll go. I'm not afraid. But... What do I do once I get there? You'll have to stop it using your own strength. 
You already succeeded in reaching the throne. I'm sure you can do it. If you will make me myself again, I'll do whatever it takes. As long as my powers continue to affect this place, the flow of the evil spirit into you will be slowed down. Go quickly! I'm going. I appreciate your help. Alright, and so with that, the game continues! And we get the Black Panther! Uh, so the Black Panther is so good because what it allows you to do is you get to go fast! Look how fast I'm going! It's so amazing! Can you believe it? Um, and it does take up magic, uh, but not a, not a lot of magic, so it's still really good to have this soul. Um, also, even more amazing about this is, um, you can actually, um, uh, where am I going? Uh, okay, we're, we're, we're just gonna go down. Um, even more amazing is you can dash right through enemies, and enemies do get hurt by your dash attack, which is so crazy. Uh, where is the warp? Okay, it's it's this room below. All right. Wow, <laughs> I got destroyed there. Uh, but yeah. So now, if you're wondering where we're supposed to go, uh, we have to go to the floating garden now, because uh, if you remember, uh, in the floating garden, uh, we needed uh, there was like a. A dark portal that we couldn't get past, so we're gonna do that now. But first, I'm gonna make my way back to Hammer's shop. Yoko, please don't die. She appears to be asleep. Dracula is. Whoa, she she is just hallucinating. I thought she knew. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Welcome back, uh, you're you're Soma, aren't you? Yeah. What happened to you? You look so scary. Nothing happened. <laughs> okay then. Hey Mina. What? If I weren't Soma anymore, how would you feel? What's wrong with you? Listen, if I... If I look like me, but... If on the inside I was someone else, how would you... How would that make you feel? What the heck am I saying? Forget what I just said, Mina, okay? I might not look like you anymore. Oh, okay. That's how it is. Please forgive me if I ever change. What do you mean, forgive you? It's nothing. I must leave now. Well, that's unfortunate. Wait, why don't I talk to her again? You've been acting strange recently. That's not true. It's not like you to hide something from me. Sorry, but I just can't tell you this. I've got to go. Uh oh. Well, that's not good. Our our our, our friendship's gonna die now. You seem different. Did something happen? No, nothing happened. Okay. That's all. All right. So you can buy some potions. You can also buy. You you probably want to stock up on as many things as you can. By the way, you can only you can only have a total of nine things of nine of each item. In case you didn't know. Um, you can buy a high mind up as well. I'm not gonna worry about that. Uh, and then you can also get some of these weapons as well. So, yeah. And the Soul Eater Ring is still expensive. That's okay, because we're not we're not trying to get 100% all souls. Okay. So now we have to go to we have to go back to the floating garden. And to go about with it is, you know, it's pretty simple, so, because we, we've been there already. We just gotta make our way there. It's pretty cool that we're able to dash through all these enemies, though. Alright, so then head up here. And we made it to the back to the floating garden. All right. Uh, so if I remember correctly, in order to go about with um, 
this. We, uh... No. There's a very specific path that we need to take in order to, in order to get there. Uh... I think we have to go right again. And, okay, there, here, here we go. Alright, so I'm gonna save. Uh, because... Uh, what's coming up is quite a tough fight. In fact, uh, hopefully I have it. I do. You want to have this weapon. Um, even though the claim is really good, uh, you want to have this weapon. Uh, it's it'll, it'll just be very convenient. But anyway, this is now opened up, so we head on through. Stop! Julius... So you are the one. I didn't want to believe it was true. It's true. I am Dracula, but I'm not what you think I am. I must destroy Dracula at any cost. That is my destiny. No, wait! I don't want to fight against you. Nothing you can say will stop me. Prepare to die! Alright! So, this is Julius, and the fight against Julius is pretty tough. But this is a really cool fight. Um, we have really cool music. Um... And Dracula has a variety of different attacks that we have to um, that you have to be careful of. Um, so he he has the vampire killer. It hurts. Um, and he also has the uh, he he can also teleport as well. Um, your dash can also hurt him. Also, dang. Oh boy. Uh, but um, the uh. This weapon that I'm using is the reason why I, I... This fight is the reason why I equip, I equip this weapon that I'm using right now. Because uh, it's a dark weapon, and he's weak to dark attacks. Um, so it's very good to have um, this, uh, this weapon against this fight. Um, as you can see, it does 100 damage. Uh, most other attacks, will re he will resist. Uh, and by that, I mean he will, um, it barely does any damage. Like, my dash attack barely does any damage whenever I'm hitting him. Uh, this move right here hurts if you get hit by it. So, I'm, I got really lucky to avoid it. Alright, so when you do enough damage to him, uh, he will then, he will start using his sub-weapons. So, we have the cross, we have the holy water, that's the cross right there. Um, the other sub that he that he just used, I forget what it is, but now he has the axe. Um, and all of his sub weapons hurt, just like every, uh, just like all of his other attacks. And that's the holy water right there. So you want to be careful about about that. We won! Stop! I've had enough. Why? Why won't you finish me off? took it easy on me. I could tell the strength of a Belmont. No, the strength of a vampire hunter is greater than this. When I fought you, I felt the evil spirit within you, but there's more. I also sent Soma's spirit, and that's more than enough to stop me. I've got a favor to a ask of you. What is it? From here, I will set off to fight against my own fate. If I lose the battle, and I become the reincarnation of evil, I want you to kill me. I will, I promise. Thanks. Now I can go into this battle without reservations. Farewell, my friend. Don't let me use that whip again. Okay. And so if you head over here, I believe this is, uh... Uh, well... Well, now I can't show it off. I'm missing 4% of... 0.4% uh, of the map. That's unfortunate. Wait, actually, hold on. Uh... Well then, <laughs> I'm missing 0.4% of that. Okay, that's okay. Like I said, I, I didn't really intend on going for 100% map completion like I did in my other playthrough. Um, but I did show off basically everything that I wanted to show off of the, um, of the, of the castle. But you can go back and, uh, like, explore uh, and continue exploring the castle if you want. So if I wanted to, I could go back to... The, um, what? If I could, if, so, if I, if I 
wanted to, I can go back to, like, explore and find that 0.4% of the map that I want to, that I wanted, that, that I could get, but I'm not really concerned about that. Alright, so, um, I'm gonna go ahead and, and uh, equ equip my, my claim again. Uh, so, this place is, um, it, it's a pretty strange place. Um, basically what we got is, um, what we got is, um, the Chaotic Realm, and, um, in the Chaotic Realm, there, it's full of all these areas that you have already seen. You've seen basically every every single one of these areas. Um, except for these like occasional dead end rooms. Okay. Um, the difference about these rooms is that is obviously of course uh, they look different. Um, like there's all there are these like little haze like they look all hazed out, pretty much. And then there's also different enemies. Um, some of which being harder variations of enemies that we've dealt with. Um, or we have, uh, there's only like three unique enemies in, in this place. And, uh, we'll encounter those unique enemies soon. And man, even after, even after, uh, like, knowing how to deal with these enemies, I'm still getting myself destroyed. That's pretty sad. So we got the Creaking Skull there. And another dead end room right there. Uh, one of these dead end rooms will contain a, a pretty uh, good item if you get all the souls in the game, which obviously we're not gonna do, and you won't be seeing that in this playthrough. Uh, but um, the en the item though, this unique item though, allows you to have infinite magic, which by the time you really get it, you're not going to really put any use of it at all. So it's not really a very useful item. Uh, this right here is a fake item bag. So yeah, this place isn't very... It's not a very long area. And this is, like, your last opportunity to gain some levels. Also, a few rooms before the room that I'm in right now, we encountered a unique enemy... Another new enemy. Uh, it is the... Aleus? Or whatever? I, I I already I already forgot, but it's a stronger variation of a nemesis. And then we also have the Demon Lord there. Another unique enemy. Okay. And then unfortunately, of course, we have water. Wow. That's all I can get if you go up there. Yeah, nothing else if you head over here. So we're just going to just head on forward. Now we have this room. Ha ha ha! Can't get me. And uh, we got a final guard here. Please stop blocking. There we 
we go. And you're guarding a super potion, which you probably want. All right, level up. Pretty nice to get a. It, it's it's really good if you can get a couple levels uh, into um, before heading off to the final part. There is nothing up there, so we're going to continue onwards. And look, clock tower uh, air areas with Medusa heads, gold Medusa heads to be more exact. It's so fun. And then coming into a water area, which how can you have, how can you like go into like a room with wa with water when the previous room wasn't water? It just makes no sense. And look, another new enemy, Shadow Knight. This, en this enemy's defense is very low. I mean, 300 damage. Yeah. Oh, tried my best not to get stoned there. Wow. Alistair, that's what these enemies are called. Okay. No! Come on! Yeah, goodbye. Oh, no, you're not dead. You're... No, come on, you're not dead. Okay, there we go. Man, am I gonna die before actually heading, getting to the to the final area? That's gonna be sad. Bye bye. Oh, another suck of a soul. Oh, whoa. Come on. There we go. Okay. Yeah, that's it. We're healing. Wow, it seems like he has really bad physical attack, as what it seems like. Fake enemy right there. I did, I did not fall for it because I knew that was going to be a fake enemy. And we made it. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and equip that. And then you want to save? And then we head on. I'm finally here. I wonder if I can do this alone. You're not alone. What? Everyone remaining in the castle combined their powers to contact you. Does that mean they all know that I'm Dracula? Yes, Arakato told us everything. I bet they're all afraid of me. No, not at all. At first we were shocked, but everyone believes you'll get through this. I'm going to send you a message from, from them now. Listen, you'll visit my shop again, won't you? I'll be waiting for you. Good morning, Soma. I just heard about what happened to you. I told you this before. You are who you are, and you mustn't let him win to the man who beat me. Don't disappoint me now. This is your last chance, and ours as well. I'm counting on you. They're all rooting for me. You can do it, because I believe in you. Mina. All right, here I go. All right. So, first thing is that our souls are gone. We cannot use our souls at all. Uh, so, we have to do this fight uh, soulless. But that's fine, because this, this, this phase isn't really that bad. All you have to do is just keep on attacking uh, these guys, and that's pretty much it. Although, I'm being pretty careless right now. I've already lost, like, more than half my HP. Um, and... Um, now I got all my souls back. All right, so now we have the second phase. All right, so this phase is uh, very annoying. Um, so you have to defeat that the, the, that thing on the top in the middle. However, uh, you cannot attack it um, because of oh I died
Sorry I kept you waiting. Time to keep that promise I made you. Farewell. Thank you.